Welcome back, today, we're going to explore the amazing features of the Photo Review Plugin Shortcode. If you're a website owner who wants to showcase reviews, enable a review form, display review counts and overall rating, this is the script you've been waiting for. So, let's get started. You can use any page builder plugin to customize your page. In this video, I'll use Elementor to illustrate. After you have a review page, first, you may want to show all reviews. Let's drag this element. Now here is where you can get the shortcode. Copy it and place it to your shortcode input field. Here is the result. And if you want to customize it, you can use these available parameters. Right below the shortcodes, you can find our detailed written documentation, with all info you need to manage the shortcode. Let's try changing the column, and make reviews show as slider, Check the result on front end. Now I'll change the style, make it show as WooCommerce default style. You can customize and function the shortcode with all its arguments. Show all reviews or specific reviews. All can be done. That's it when you want to showcase reviews on a review page. Now, let's see how to show reviews on a product page. Also drag and place the shortcode. On a product page, shortcode auto display reviews of that exact product. You won't need product ID there, and you can still customize all other arguments just like on a review page. Other than reviews, you may also need a review form for user to leave feedback. We also have shortcode for that. I'll place it above the reviews, then copy the shortcode to show review form and place it to the element. On a specific product page, you don't need product ID, just put the basic shortcode and it'll work. However, on the review page, it's slightly different. Here you can see, after adding shortcode and save the settings, there's no review form yet. You need to do one more step, select the review page here in the settings. Now when customer receives the review reminder email, or when they want to review via their orders section, in my account page, they'll be redirected to the review form in this review page. If you want the form to be always visible on the review page, you need to fill in the product ID. It's because the form needs to be assigned to specific products. With product ID argument, the form is visible for all customers, and their review in that form will be for that product only. Otherwise, user can only see and use the form after being redirected to by review now button or via orders. After you're happy with the basic elements on a review page, let's add one more element that shows up average rating. Overall rating, it's important to note that it requires at least one product ID to make it visible. You can see it's not working without an ID here. You can add more than one ID. The short code will calculate the average rating of all products with ID listed in the parameter. Overall rating shortcode on single product page, on the other hand, doesn't require product ID to work. By default, it'll show the overall rating of that product. Lastly, we have a shortcode to display product rating. I'll place it between product title and price, but you can add it anywhere you like, This shortcode shows rating star and review count. If the rating argument is empty, it'll show the exact average rating of that product. You can add your wanted rating here as well, 